<laughs> Jamie and Connie Meave love their 2007 Dodge pickup, maybe most of all, because it's all paid off. When their check engine light popped on late last year, they took it to Meineke in the Heights. I like to choose a neighborhood type of uh, operation. Yeah. There they checked the diagnostics and... They told us that we needed a new catalytic converter. They did the job in two days, got home, and the light came right back on. Another trip and a replaced fuel injector. By now, the Meeves had paid more than $1,000 and the light came on again. They looked at it and they just raised their hands and said, you're going to have to take it to a dealership. Let me pull out the notes so I can... Mimo Martinez, who manages the Heights Meineke, confirmed that's what happened, but says he just wanted them to get better diagnostics at the dealer and then come back to him for the repair. Connie said no. The trust was gone, basically. The trust was gone. The dealer replaced the whole catalytic converter. Meineke had just done half. I cut one, the one that was bad. Well, Mechanics tell us that's not always a successful repair. Either way, the Meeves thought they shouldn't have to pay twice for catalytic converter repairs and asked Meineke for a refund. Who's the decision really up to? That would be the owner. After months of waiting for a decision from the owner, nothing. Connie called us, and for more than a month, we tried to connect with Meineke's corporate office. Finally, we did, and they called Connie. I think the only reason why I really heard from them is because you guys got involved. The Meeves showed us the refund check for the full amount they spent with Meineke, their truck still running well. I was very, very thankful, and we felt like we're very blessed. In this case, it really worked out for them, no. but you're not necessarily yeah. entitled to that. We'll explain that in just a sec, but from Meineke's point of view, it took a long time for us to get in touch with their corporate parent. But once we finally did, Driven Brands told us customer satisfaction and quality service are the, the utmost importance. We've been in contact with this customer and reached a mutual, uh, mutually agreeable resolution. As I said, for the rest of us guys, Ryan Marquez at the U of H Center for Consumer Law says what matters most is what's written on your estimate. Don't necessarily rely on what the person says to you, but you have to rely on the estimate. Uh, so if they say we're going to fix this problem, then they'll fix it. If they say we're going to replace a part, that's all you're entitled to. Uh